Oh, you love water, Sammy. Yes. The Brita XL water filter dispenser. Forty dollars. That's a eleven dollar savings. Wow. wow. Eleven bucks. I don't do tap I, water. I don't. I don't do Brita. I get bottled water. It gets me sick. Have you done like the Brita pitcher I, like at home and stuff? I did when I was in college, but we probably just didn't change the filter enough, which is why it wasn't okay. great. Because you walk around with that Stanley thing that's massive. It's yes. as big as she is. It is. But right. like all these chicks are carrying those things around. So like when you're at home by yourself, like mm-hmm. you go, you have like bottles of water that you dump them into this. Yes, wow. I have jugs of water that I put, I pour into my cup. Can't you just get like a, like some kind of system, like a dispenser? That just seems like like yeah. a faucet, right? <laughs> <laughs> Tell mean, your landlord you need a faucet. Well, no, there's got to be like some kind of water filtration thing. There's like that on you the refrigerator do. and there, stuff. There, but literally any number. The refrigerator yeah. water tastes weird. Yeah, I haven't not, tried a Brita that. in a long time, though. They could be great. Maybe I should yeah. invest. Hey, I, I thought about you, Seabass. Ooh, um, thank you. Yeah. Not that way. Somebody posted something. I'm like, oh, my God. we were Because we were just talking about this. Re- this is all it's from a chick. Nice. Who uh, posted online. Her name's Chloe. Men who carry water bottles out in public give me the ick, <laughs> especially <laughs> at the airport. You can't go a few hours without having your little sips of water. <laughs> Carrying around anything is a feminine trait. The only thing men should be carrying around are his wallet and a pocket knife. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Wait, why are we? I'm not the first person to make this observation, but, but not just dudes. You were talking about like everybody, right? Like we're suddenly everybody's always so hydrated, so <laughs> under hydrated, exactly. dehydrated. It's a weird phenomenon. Yeah. If, if only you could like get a glass, fill it up, yeah. drink it, wait a couple hours. Yeah. But I, I know, it's, it's become this thing. It's like it's a, it's an accessory, and you know, right, like, it's yeah, right. Different brands. Well, oh. you get cool stickers on your cup and stuff. Exactly, oh, stickers. Oh. Like but, my kids when they go to school on the back to school list every year is a water bottle. Why? Oh yeah, I would. Yeah. I, like, it's a re, it's a required thing. Like you know, you would for pencils and you know notebooks and things like that. It says you know that they need to have their. And I was like, well, I asked my uh, my kids, are there not water fountains? We had water fountains. Yeah, right. Yeah. Oh, no, we have but, those, but they're like bottle, bottle fillers. Oh, my yeah. God. But, uh, Seabass, you're a science guy. Shouldn't we be drinking a lot of water? But we have all the ways, and we have had yeah. all the ways to drink water forever. <laughs> they're called cups. They're called water fountains. We figured out the problem, and we solved it. And you have them at all times. Like, like Sammy, even she leaves the room for like two minutes. She's carrying that thing with her. <laughs> and then we talked I about- I do. I drink it all like, the time. Just in case she becomes dehydrated in the in the four seconds that she's out of <laughs> yeah. the room, yeah, how, she'll, have, how she'll have like a, a week's worth of water on her in that mm-hmm. Stanley cup that she's got. There is a weird comfort that comes with it. I can't leave the house without That's water. That's what it is. It's yeah. so strange. I have relatives who had a 4th of July party. Somebody showed up with their water bottle. Yes. You're going to a, somebody's home <laughs> yeah. that has water. Well, you don't know what kind of water it's going to yeah, be. It could be sink this is, water. This is our who point. Cares? Like, who cares? Yeah. That's I mean, fine. And, and like that quote, you can't go two hours. You can't go to a party without your water. I mean, what have we become? I go to parties with my water. You do? Yes. That's awkward. Because I'll I always have one with me, so it's not like oh I have to bring my own water. You it's never like have to. I always have my own water. If your party, unless your party is <laughs> in the, the desert, and that desert. damn rock is shaped like a U. <laughs> if we had, let's, let's okay, so let, let's just say somebody here is throwing like a a barbecue, like okay, sea yeah. bass is uh, gathering. Yeah, had a lovely would, housewarming party. But you yeah. weren't like you would have brought your a water your own bottle water with you. I would definitely have it, and then I would debate whether I should bring it in from my car or not. But yes, yeah. it would be with me, and depending on the scenario, I'll bring it in. This happens all the time. Uh, Again, yeah. I think we, it started with we have to drink bottled water, which was a mm-hmm. total, complete lie. But as what Sammy's just proved here, yep. she buys bottled water to pour into her. Yeah. Yes. Right. It, it tastes started, better, it though. It started with that, and people said, hey, how else can we sell things to dummies? Right. Then there was, yeah. na- there, there was Nalgene. <laughs> now we have uh, – oh, but I was in a Dick Sporting Good over the weekend – Yeti has half the floor. Nice. And, and it's oh. besides the coolers, it is a lot of these stupid little yeah. pitchers for people, yeah. personal pitchers. Not necessary. And they're huge. Some of them talk. Oh. <laughs> have, you, have you seen those? <laughs> no. Really? Yeah, they beep and stuff. Yeah, they oh. beep or they give you like some Ooh, kind of like music. verbal thing about you like are, you need more water. Yeah. Do you ever see like that thing on your uh, Apple Watch, like time to breathe? It's, it's <laughs> one of those things like reminding you to take some water in. And I I've as, as a platinum elite status member with uh, Marriott Bonvoy, every time I check in, they hand me two water bottles, and I and I say no thanks. They, are yeah. you? Sh-? And they, they always say, "Well, oh, shocked. Are you? Sh- are you sure?" It's like, "Well, yeah, you have taps, right, and cups, right?" They're like, 
yeah, but these are free. It's like, I don't want them. <laughs> these are free. And I look, I'm all for killing the dolphins, killing the turtles. <laughs> yeah, right. I, this is not about that. It's just about where we've created a whole yeah. industry for no reason. Right. It's, and it's I like bet a, it's like a see. It is kind of like it, I, I get why it's handy, man. If you're thirsty, man, you have something right there. Sure. Great. Yeah. Okay, but it has become sort of. It seems like a security blanket. Yeah. Absolutely. An Ooh. emotional support water bottle. Right. Yeah. I want one. But I mean, <laughs> it's not doing any harm. It's for hydration. It is it's doing harm. It no, is doing a lot of harm, harm to the environment. Lie, lie, Why? Lie, 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 lie. Again, I'm all for killing any animal out there all the time, but it is definitely creating all kinds of waste. <laughs> yes. So much trash. <laughs> you hate Mother Earth. I didn't go, look at it like that to me. I really yeah. didn't. So if you go to a restaurant, um, you're always ordering the bottle. Like they say, like, uh, can I get you still sparkling? Oh, they're tricky with that sometimes too. Uh, exactly. They, you're like mm-hmm. still or still sparkling. You gotta bottled. go. I'll take house, house, house water, wa- or, house or, or water. ice, ice water. Yeah, they're trying to oversell. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because yeah. as soon as you say still, they bring you the bottled oh, stuff. That's right. There's, yeah. And there's certain casinos. I, I was at one on Fremont Street where I couldn't get them to just give me because I want like a, a cocktail and a glass of water. And he was like, and I tr- like just no, whatever you got out of the gun, I don't care. Yeah. It was a squirt right. gun. Uh, but no, he had to go and like get a little. Eight ounce, unlo- oh un- did the, yeah. the lid, really? and poured it into the cup. Well, oh. yeah. um, Joe Button, the podcaster, Joe Button, he he's convinced. He's like, "Have you ever seen a cap on those those bottles that they bring out at the restaurant? Oh, when never you ask for still water. Yeah, never. He's They're like, just filling that up. <laughs> yeah. They're filling that up oh, with the whoa, dishwasher, whoa, whoa, right? <laughs> Whatever's like, coming out of the dishwasher, that's what like, they're putting in like, there. Ask for one with a cap on it. And yeah. See if you get it. I, if you guys really want to be cool and prepared, you can walk around with one of those Camelbacks on. Oh, yeah, at all times. And you have that, like, uh, tube that comes over your shoulder (laughs) that clips onto your collar. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, that, just in case. That's cool. (laughs)